I didn't pursue him. I just uh, walked down and uh, I helped the little girl. She was she was down on the floor, bloody, crying, and shot. Doorman Hector Mateo wished he could have done more to capture this would-be rapist. Police are still searching for this man, who they say tried to rape a 19-year-old woman right near Gracie Mansion early Saturday morning, 1.15 a.m. The 19-year-old female was walking near East End Avenue and 90th Street when police say she was approached by this man who pushed her to the ground and tried to rape her. We heard screaming. My husband and I were woken up uh, from screams saying, help me, help me. Um, and when we came downstairs, I came downstairs first. We had other neighbors that had already responded and they were with her. She was here um, in front of the building. Other neighbors called 911 as doorman Mateo grabbed a flashlight and allegedly scared the would-be rapist as he went to comfort the young female victim. His instincts kicked up. And uh, he said, it's time to go, you know, and he started running. She was shook up, but, you know, he, the, from what she said, the guy tried to put his hands down her pants. The good news is that the guy didn't get to rape her or anything. Police say the would-be rapist ran west on 90th Street and is described as a male, 5'9", dark complexion, wearing a dark-colored suit, blue jeans, and multicolored shoes. Neighbors are concerned but praise the quick work of the doorman. It was just terrifying, and I was so thankful that the doorman were there, and I really appreciate them because they are a vital part of this city. Is he a hero to you? Absolutely. He, what he did was incredible, and I applaud him for it, absolutely.